hey you guys welcome back to my channel if you are new go ahead and hit the subscribe button and the notification bell so let's go ahead and get into the tutorial for today so today we are going to be doing the lazy girl method and i did go ahead and pull out my well quinn full cover extra long square nail tips and I'm just going to go in with this cheap poly gel that I got off of Amazon in dark pink. And we're just going to apply that into all of the nails. But I'm not going to take it up to the cuticle area. I'm just going to um, apply it not at the cuticle area and cure it. But I'm going to speed it up so you guys can see what I'm talking about. So this is how the nails are looking and I'm going to go ahead and flash cure that and while that's flash curing I am going to go in and do my pop off method which is cuticle oil and base coat. This is what my nails are looking like out of the um, out of the lamp, and now I'm just gonna go in with the cuticle bead, which will be just a small bead, um, and I'm just gonna pat that out and apply the nails, and then I'm gonna apply my nails in a mini lamp, um, just for like a splash cure, so they can stay into place. And then once all of them are on, I do go ahead and go in the big lamp for a total of 60 seconds. this is how the nails are looking I am going to go ahead and clean them off with some 90% um, alcohol and that is going to remove that sticky tack as well and once I do go ahead and clean off the nails we're gonna move on to um, shaping and e-fouling
pulled out my my eval and I'm going in with this cone cone shape safety bit because I did have some spillage and I did want to make these um, nails as flush as possible so I did go ahead and pull out that eval but you don't have to pull out an eval you can definitely um, achieve this with um, your hand file I would just say get an um, 80 80 grit hand file So after I go in with the comb bed, I take my nippers because I still have that spillage that I was a little scared to file um, on. So I just take my nippers and I just file that away. And then I'm just going to go in with a um, ball, ball bit and I'm going to go in around the cuticle areas to go ahead and clean everything up and make everything flush to the cuticles and sidewalls. As you've seen in the short clip, we did go ahead and buff our nails. Now we're going to go in with our 80-80 grit hand file and clean up the side walls to go ahead and crispen up our square shape. So now the nails are all file shaped, buffed and clean with alcohol, dust free. Now we're going to go in with a top coat onto all of the nails. I did one nail on camera and the rest off camera to cut in down the time of application and all of that. Because after this, it's time to get into the design of the nail. So what I'm going to be doing for the design of this nail is Mitch Match French Tips and I have all of my colors already laid out onto my palette and I'm going to um, achieve French Tips. So the easiest way for me to do the French Tips was with a liner brush and going straight down the middle, middle on where I wanted the French Tip to I guess start and then go on each side con connecting it to the middle point and then filling it in so i am going to go ahead and do that i am going to let you guys watch that i am going to speed it up because it is a process but i will be back when it's time to go ahead and design the nails
you've made it this far to the nail design and I just want to take the time <laughs> take the time to thank you for that I really do appreciate it and if you are new here go ahead and hit the subscribe button and the notification bell and if you are feeling generous go ahead and comment down below and if you like the video and like the nail design and enjoy the video so far go ahead and like and comment I think I just said that okay wow repeating myself but anyways back to the nails um, as you can tell this is going to be a cow print um, nail the um, yellow nail is going to be a smiley face the blue nail should have been um, a cloud nail but I didn't do it it's just some squiggly lines and the purple nail is going to be a croc print and my thumb is going to be some orange dots I'm going to go ahead and speed it up and I'm going to let you guys watch the video and I did go ahead and cure each nail in between because I didn't want to make any incidents with bumping it and you know having to do it all over so I did go ahead and do a flash cure between each of the nails. Yeah. Hey, feeling young, but they treat me. 
me like the OG. And they want the tea on me, I swear these bitches nosy. Said he put some money on my head, I guess we gon' see. I won't put no money on this shit, my niggas owe me. I gotta be single for a while, you can't control me. Who know those traits in a race, they can't hold me. And I show my face in a case, so you know it's me. Imitation is a flattery, it's just annoying me. And I'm too about it. And the dirt that they do on my name turn to soil and I grew up by it. Time for y'all to figure out what y'all gon' do about it. Big wheels keep rolling and rolling. I'm outside, 29, G5, Seaside. I've been losing friends and finding peace. Now that all of the vines are on, I did go ahead and cure them in the big lamp for a total of 60 seconds. Now I'm going to go in with a juicy layer of top coat and I'm going to top coat all of the nails. So now it's time to apply the cuticle oil and as you see I did it off camera I did apply some iridescent um, gems in the center of the nail and that was it that's all I did but I'm just gonna go ahead and apply my cuticle oil rub that in and show you guys some angles of this nail set this nail set was really fun to do it was really quick really easy I really love this nail set I'll probably do more like it so just go ahead and stay tuned and like I say hit the notification bell so that way you'll be posted on when I do come out with new nail sets. But other than that you guys this is a set. Comment down below if you like the set. I love you guys. I don't have to say it twice. I'm running out of words to say. Bye you guys. I'm a roll on